It's a spring weekend here at Windsor Raceway. The clubhouse is packed, so is the grandstand downstairs. Uh, everybody besides getting racing action has got an opportunity of winning some fabulous prizes here at the clubhouse tonight. The gate is rolling. It'll be Flyby Jonathan, Nifty Cat, and Cool Wave, Whistler's Tribute, Imperial Way, and Shadow Countess, Simply Sugar, First Deduction, and Delbertross on the outside. It's post time for the third. As they come to the post, the 9 of 5 favorite is the number 6 horse, Shadow Countess. Now, she's been racing mostly fillies and mares. She moves in now to race against the boys. So that could be a bit of a phony uh, favorite. Now I see she's the second choice, and they've made number 4, Whistler's Tribute. The 4-year-old horse by River Captain, the favorite with Bev Haywood aboard. The third race is now moving through the backstretch. And there they go. They're off and pacing. It's flyby Jonathan at the rail. Now driving out in the center of the track comes Imperial Way. Imperial Way charges out to take the lead. Flyby Jonathan on the inside second. Up on the outside third is Simply Sugar. Whistler's Tribute at the rail pace is up fourth. Nifty Count on the inside fifth. Albert Tross on the outside is sixth. Moving seventh is Cole Wave. Eighth and going to the outside now is Shadow Countess and first deduction ninth. Pacing onto the quarter pole, Imperial Way on top, the quarter in 29 and 2. They're off the turn of the stretch, Imperial Way fronts the field by one. On the outside, Simply Sugar Pace is up second, in at the rail, fly by Jonathan is third. Moving up fourth, Whistler's Tribute, fifth up on the outside now, comes Shadow Callis. In at the rail, six is Nifty Count. Moving up seventh on the outside is Cool Wave, eight is Delbert Tross, and first deduction ninth. Pacing into the clubhouse turn, it's uh, Imperial Way with the lead by a full length now, reaching the half in a minute flat. Imperial Way on top, getting the trip at the rail, fly by Jonathan second, and uh, roughing it on the outside is Simply Sugar pacing third, now taking over third at the rail is Whistler's Tribute, going three wide down the back stretch is Shadow Countess. They're heading for the three quarters. Imperial Way leads by two. Fly by Jonathan second. Shadow Countess up on the outside takes over third. In at the rail, Whistler's Tribute is fourth as they approach the three quarter pull. Imperial Way on top by two. The three quarters in one thirty and four. Pacing on around the turn with the lead. By two lengths, it's Imperial Way. Shadow Countess edging up on the outside. Second down at the rail, fly by Jonathan. Now looks for room. Moving to the outside, fourth is Whistler's Tribute. They're off the turn and into the stretch. Imperial Way has to lead by two lengths. Shadow Countess up on the outside, second. Down to the wire, Imperial Way with Shadow Countess and Cole Wave on the outside. Down to the wire, Imperial Way and Cole Wave, and here they are. The number five horse, Imperial Way, goes off at 7 to 1. The three horse, Cole Way, finishes second at 9 to 1. And Shadow Countess finishes up third. Here's Imperial Way in the winner's circle right now. He is a black nine year old gelding by Goodenough. This is a former invitational pacer here at the track, getting a little aged now. He's nine years old. And he hangs on to win this one over Cole Way, closing up on the far outside with Shadow Countess between horses. Imperial Way returns 1710, 960, 390. Number three, Cole Wave, 1120, 570. And the six horse, Shadow Countess, paid 250 to show. The Exactor, 14840. And the Triactor paid 348. Down in the winner's circle following that race with the man who has been a great ambassador for harness racing over his years, winning driver, George Robinson. George, you put him in the lead and let him go from there. Tell us about the race. Well, I just. He likes the front anyways. He's never been really good in a hole, and I made the front tonight, and it was just a matter of who outlegged who, really. For those of uh, you watching from outside of the Windsor area, you should know that the $5,000 claimers are the lowest price claimers on the grounds, yet you went down to the three quarters and won 30 and four. Did you want to go that much to the three quarters? Well, he's a funny horse. Like, if you let him slow down, he'll take advantage of it, and he'll come back and get lazy. As long as you're chasing him and you got him running, he likes it a lot better, and it, and uh, he likes it when he's ahead of the horses. The whole Mile. So he's got to be out front and rolling. Yeah, really, he does. Let's ask you something personal. You gave up driving for uh, a little bit uh, earlier this year because of a shoulder injury. Uh, it must obviously be healed by now. Definitely healed. George, thank you and congratulations. Super winning drive. Thank you. George Robinson, winning driver with Imperial Way, now up into the clubhouse. Here's Ken. 